Isn't Little Miss Trouble kind? Little Miss Trouble is out for a drive with Mr Mischief in his car. It has just stopped raining. <laughs> My dear Little Miss Trouble, shall we drive through a big puddle and splash Mr Dizzy? No, don't do that. I've decided to be kind today. Pull over next to Mr Dizzy. I'll have some chocolates for him. <laughs> with mustard filling? Mr. Dizzy, would you care for a chocolate? Uh, no, thank you, Little Miss Trouble. Uh, I've been told that you aren't a kind person. Now, who told you that? I am not a telltale, and I promised Mr. Stamp that I wouldn't repeat what Mr. Greedy and Little Miss Splendid had said to him. Go ahead and splash him. <laughs> oh, Little Miss Trouble is very annoyed. Poor Mr. Stamp. Poor Mr. Greedy, poor little Miss Splendid. They don't know what's in store for them. <laughs> These are what I call real presents. <laughs> Hello, post office, is that you, Mr. Stamp? <laughs> little Miss Trouble has some presents to deliver. <laughs> Could you drop by? Here is our first visitor. Do come in, Mr. Stamp. Oh, I, oh. Where am I? Oh, poor Mr. Stamp, you really are very unlucky. <laughs> Little Miss Trouble and I will go and deliver the parcels while you dry off. <laughs> mm. Who dares bother me at tea time? <laughs> A present for you, Mr. Greedy. Oh. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Oh, great. Oh, it will just do for a dessert. <laughs> so maybe I'm not a kind person, but I do make a lovely hot pepper tart. <laughs> mirror, mirror, on the wall. Oh, excuse me. A present for you, Little Miss Splendid. Yet another admirer. Thank you, my good man. Oh, what a lovely mirror. Oh, what has happened to me? I'm so ugly. The distorting mirror trick was fun, wasn't it? Let's take this present round to Mr Dizzy. That will teach him to spread rumours. Hello, Mr Dizzy. <laughs> What are you looking for? I'm looking for hen's teeth. <laughs> but hens don't have teeth. But I was told that I'd be intelligent the day <laughs> hens have teeth. I have a present for you. Oh, you shouldn't have. Try them on. Oh. Oh, aren't they a, a little small for me? Not at all. They'll soon stretch. And the best way is for you to walk round town ten times. All right, here I go. Oh. Little Miss Trouble must be kind. After all, she has given me such a lovely pair of shoes. In fact, I really should give Little Miss Trouble something in return. I know what. I'll give her a bracelet made of honey-filled sweets. A present for you, Little Miss Trouble. Poor old Dizzy's present is a little sticky. <laughs> Mr Dizzy's gift certainly taught Little Miss Trouble the biggest lesson of all. You see, bees just love. Honey-filled sweets. <laughs> <laughs>